Hey guys, it's Dave, your mortgage guy. Com. And in this video, I'm going to go over whether or not home equity lines of credit, HELOCs, are a good thing or a bad thing. But before I do that, please subscribe to my YouTube channel to keep up with more videos like this. So I've seen some quote unquote experts saying that a home equity line of credit is a horrible idea and that you should not have one. And I wanted to break down why I disagree with that why I have them myself, and why I believe you should also. So a home equity line of credit is a second mortgage for the most part after your first mortgage, allowing you to access equity in your home, taking cash out, without having to refinance your first mortgage, okay? So a second mortgage. And the line of credit part is that it allows you to borrow up to a max, but you don't have to borrow that amount. It's a line of credit, so you could borrow very little, half as much, the whole amount, whatever it is. Keep in mind a couple of things. Many of them are gonna be interest only, which is where the mortgage payment is just paying toward interest. They may have a 10 year term, a 20 year term, a 30 year term, right? So there's different options. So make sure you understand that. Um, keep in mind, this is a great option for um, using that money toward other things. Let's say if your AC goes out and you don't have the access to credit or cash to pay for it or your roof. I actually used my first home equity line of credit to get the down payment to buy my first rental property. I did not have the cash to put it down. And so I borrowed it against my house and it allowed me to buy an investment property. You could use this for other things. And building a pool, investing in a company, using that money to buy your new home or the down payment on your new home. And then when you sold your home, paid off that home equity line of credit. So there's a lot of benefits, okay? The interest is tax deductible, okay? Completely different than the interest you're paying on a credit card. So you've got that advantage, right? And I think a lot of the experts that are saying it's a horrible idea is that they don't think you have enough financial education to know how to use a line of credit or credit in general, or you would know, I'm gonna borrow this amount and aggressively pay it back. When I bought my rental property, I made a promise to myself, I'm gonna aggressively pay that money back within a year, <clears throat> and so it didn't concern me borrowing against it, okay? And so a home equity line of credit is a fantastic option. And here's the thing, you can borrow a lot, a little, or none. So once I bought my rental property, I never used that home equity line of credit again. I recently refinanced it to increase the balance, the high credit limit, and I may never touch that one. But I like having access to it in case something was to come up where I needed that money. It's better to be prepared than not to, okay? Especially as some banks have stopped doing these types of loans, right? So if you have access to one, it's a fantastic option, okay? So again, home equity line of credit, a fantastic mortgage product to have. I'm a believer in it. I use it in my own personal life, my personal finances, and that's why I'm saying to have a home equity line of credit is a great idea. Just make sure you aggressively pay toward it, okay? Call or email me anything, comment down below, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and if you find my videos helpful, I'd love to be your lender. Thanks, guys.